Hey everyone, welcome back Crown Geek here. So if you're also tired of the old and the dull Windows File Explorer and you want to make it like this or maybe like this So today in this video, I will be showing you how to completely transform your file explorer into something way modern, clean, elegant without slowing down your system or breaking anything. So the process will be very simple and the tool that we will be using is safe and very trusted and a popular tool that's called Windhawk. So what you will have to do, bring up any of your browser, search for Windhawk. Then click on this first website windog.net and here you will have to click on download and it's a small file so it will be quickly downloaded. So go with the basic installation, click on the setup file, click on yes and install the windhog on your device. I have already installed so it's asking me to reinstall or uninstall so I will cancel it. But once you will install it, you will see this kind of dashboard of the windhog. Now here the very first thing that you will have to do. On the right in top, you will have to click on explore, then click on search for a mod and here you have to search for a mod by the name resource redirect. So type resource and in the suggestion you will be getting resource redirect, this one. Click on detail, click on install, click on accept risk and install. Now once this mod has been installed, it will be helping us to change the uh, look and appearance of the file explorer. So next we have to find out the theme that we need to select and you don't have to go to anywhere else here only if you scroll down a bit in the icon theme section only you will find uh, this link that says resource redirect icon theme just click on this link here and this will redirect you to the github page and here if you scroll down so you will find all kind of different themes over here so look for a preview here you can scroll down and look for the theme whichever you like the most you will have to select it all right so i will take few example here so let's say if i want to go with the faber uh, symbolic or maybe whichever you like you will have to click on that name here once you click you will come to this kind of page and here on the right in top or right hand side you will find this option of download you will have to click on download raw file click on it and wait for some time and the zip file will be downloaded once downloaded, open the downloaded folder, make a right click on it, click on extract all, click on extract and once the file get extracted, you can delete the zip file here. Now copy the extracted folder, then from the left hand side, click on this PC, go to local disk C and here you have to make a right click on the blank space, over up to new, choose folder, name it PACK pack or you can give any other name like mod once created again make a double click on it and paste the extracted folder that you have copied once you have pasted it now open the folder again open it and once you come to this location where you find all the theme icon and everything just copy the path from the top select it right click on it and choose copy then bring up the windhawk and here in the resource redirect mod only, you will have to click on settings. Then scroll down a bit. And below the theme path, you will have to paste the path over here. Click on save settings. Minimize it. Alright, now you will have to restart the file explorer so that the changes can be applied. So I will right click on the taskbar, click on task manager. I will look for the Windows Explorer, right click on it and click on restart. And the next time when I will bring up the file explorer, so bingo, now you can see the file explorer look and feel has been changed. You can see the drive icon, the DVD drive icon on the left hand side, the pin icon has been created. So this was the one theme and so on. If you want to add some more, then again you will have to go to the same website where you selected the theme. This time you can pick any other theme, whichever you like. So keep scrolling. So let's say if I want to add the Mac one, so I will click on Mac OS. The procedure will be same for all the themes that you want to apply. All right. So you will have to select it. Then you will have to download the raw file. Once downloaded, open the downloaded folder, right click on it, click on extract all, click on extract. Once extracted, copy the entire folder. 
go back to this PC, local disk C, then the pack folder we created, and here we will paste our next theme folder. All right, now once you have pasted it, open it. Again, open it. I can see my theme.ini file here. So I will copy the path again. Once copied, now you will have to go back to the Windhawk so that you can paste this new path. Click on save settings. Let's again restart the file explorer. And here we go. So now you can see the file explorer icon has been now changed. And this one is the macOS dark theme edition. So you can see the look and feel. The icons are exactly the same that look in the Mac operating system. Even you can see on the very top, the home section, you can see the Mac OS icon. It looks very excellent, neat and clean. And this one is another. And the name of this mod is uh, X Minimalism Symbolic. Uh, you will get all the themes in the website that I showed you. So let me try a few more and show you so that you can know that how quickly you can change the theme without any problem. Alright, and the one that I like the most is this one. It's by the name Sweet Rainbow. Uh, let me even show you in the website. If I go back. This one, Sweet Paronia, and it's by the name Sweet Rainbow. Uh, this one looks much better, look different. However, you can try many other that are being listed. And this is exactly what it looks like. Neat and clean, colorful. And give you some different theme. Looks sweet. The icons are two different and very colorful like its theme, so it's rainbow. Alright, so this way you can also give a new uh, and elegant look to your Windows File Explorer without doing too much. It's very and very simple to use and switch between different themes. And if you enjoyed the video guys, please hit the like, subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.